Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV, a station where you watch, uh, interact and also learn. Your tutor today is Mr. Wanyoike, a mathematics teacher. In today's lesson, we are in form two, uh, in form two lesson uh, 23, and the topic is rotation, and the subtopic is rotation through a negative angle. Uh, on to the lesson objectives, uh, by the end of this lesson, uh, you should be able to, number one, plot the coordinates of an object on a Cartesian plane, and uh, number two, measure a negative angle uh, from the center of rotation, and number three, you are supposed to plot the coordinates of the image after rotation. Um, rotation through a negative angle. Uh, the angle should be measured uh, from the center of rotation in clockwise direction. And that is very, very, very important to note uh, because in most cases, uh, most learners normally make a mistake here. Uh, instead of uh, measuring the angle in clockwise direction, you find them measuring in a uh, anti-clockwise direction. And therefore, uh, whenever you have uh, a positive angle, whenever you have um, a, 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 a positive angle, uh, you are supposed to measure in anti-clockwise direction, uh, but if you have a negative angle, uh, you should use the clockwise direction when it uh, comes to uh, measuring of the angle of rotation. Uh, then uh, we'll go to example one. There is an example one here. Uh, given that the coordinates of a triangle A, B, C, R, A, negative two, four, B, negative two, two, and C, negative six, four. And the center of rotation is at its origin. Uh, determine the coordinates of the image uh, if the triangle is rotated through an angle of negative 90 degrees. Therefore, in this question, you can see that the angle given here is negative. And therefore, as I have already instructed you to do, you are supposed to measure the angle um, in clockwise uh, direction. And you can see on this diagram here, Cartesian plane, the object here, A, supposed to be negative 2, 4, and you can see in the question it was negative 2, 4. And B, uh, you can see it's supposed to be negative 2, 2, and also you can see in the question it was the same. And point C, that is the uh, coordinate C, supposed to be negative 6, 4, and on the diagram you can see it is negative 6, 4. Then after that, uh, what are you supposed to do? You're supposed to join up uh, coordinate A of the object to the center of rotation. And in this case, the center of rotation is at zero, zero. Then after that, you measure an angle of 90 degrees uh, in clockwise direction. And after measuring that 90 degrees, this line and this line becomes separated by 90 degrees. And you can see this arrow. Uh, the arrow points that the direction through which uh, the, 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 the reading is taken uh, from the protractor because we normally use a protractor when it comes to measuring of the angle. Then after drawing that, you measuring that, that uh, you are supposed to draw a straight line here. Then after drawing that line, you are supposed to measure uh, we using a compass, uh, yeah, compass and pencil, you're supposed to measure the distance from point A, that is the A of the object, to the point O. Then you likewise, you measure another equal distance, the same uh, distance along the line which was uh, uh, you had already constructed using the protractor, the angle which you measured, which was 90 degrees. Then after that, you mark the position of the coordinate A, that is the image. Then you join B to the center of rotation. Then after that, you measure an angle once again, 90 degrees. And you draw a line where the 90 degrees will be passing at. Then you measure an equal distance from point B uh, to, po to po point zero. That is to point O. That is the, the intersection of the Cartesian plane. Then you uh, measure the same distance along the uh, line where the 90 degrees is passing through. Then you mark where the image of B will be. And in this case, you can see it is here. And after that, you repeat that procedure with point C. You join C to the center of rotation. 
Then after joining it to the center of rotation, you measure 90 degrees. And 90 degrees, this line, and this line makes an angle of 90 degrees, this one. And therefore, after measuring that angle, then you measure the distance from where the point is, C is to where the center of rotation is. Then you make another dist the same distance along the line that passes where the 90 degree is so that you can locate the position of the image that is uh, the C in this case is this. And therefore the coordinates of the image becomes uh, point A1 uh, that is the image of A becomes 4, 2 and the image of B that is B1 becomes uh, 2, 2 you can see here and the image of C becomes 4, and six and that is exactly what you are supposed to do and after following that procedure you will be okay and you will get the results correct results uh, we have uh, come uh, to the end of today's lesson and I'm going to give you the following activity as an assignment and the question reads given that the triangle ABC whose coordinates are negative 2, 1, and B, uh, negative 2, 5, and C, 5, 5, uh, is rotated, uh, rotate the triangle ABC through an angle of negative 90 degrees and about the origin. Meaning that uh, the center of rotation it, uh, is at 0, 0. Therefore, you do that work as assignment. Uh, then uh, we'll go to reference. For reference, you can refer from secondary mathematics uh, uh, student book 2 and the p publisher is the Kenya Literature Bureau. For more information you can uh, uh, reach us uh, through the following addresses. You can use the SMS using the number which is well displayed for you. Uh, YouTube at LMTV, Facebook platform at LMTV still and uh, Twitter at LMTV underscore KE. Thank you for joining me in this lesson. Till next lesson. Bye bye.